Number two on Keisha Cole Week, Joe. This one's got Missy Elliott and Lil' Kim. Let it go. I think I have heard this song before, but I don't recognize the name. Well, with all these heavy hitters, I'm sure we have. So, And thank you to Jason Brown. Girl, look, why are you looking like that again? Seriously, miss? I cannot deal with these insecurities. This dude is really stressing me out. I got too much I'm trying to do. Okay, I really well, you know need what? To let it go. I don't even need to hear the story. I'm going to take you to this club around the block because I got my new <laughs> Chanel jacket. <laughs> it's hair wait, done. Is Kim coming? Uh, we're going to go pick up Kim. Okay, right, let, let it, it go. go for let's real. Go, let it go. Holla. You need to get it if he don't want to love oh, you the right yeah, way. I know. I know yeah. gonna, it ain't where he's at, it's where he, where he want to be. No yeah. But it ain't even gotta be like that <laughs> Yo man, he be calling me back He say I'm fine and a matter of fact <laughs> He asked how I do that That fit my jeans over baby fat Listen, I don't know the type of tricks he playing But I should warn you, I don't want you, man I understand why you wanna try Make him stay home late at night But if he wanna go, he'll be gone This song is classic. This is a great beat. And this beat has a classic feel. I don't uh, know if it's the same time, but it kind of gives me more of like a like a mid nineties hip hop feeling, boom, boom, right? Boom, boom. Yeah, so far back on the beat. Boom. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah, and it's got that nice bass line on there, and those beautiful keys. In the oh yeah, it's so <laughs> smooth. <laughs> oh, I'm talking about the. Oh. Yeah, I can't make chords with my mouth, but uh, <laughs> Missy Elliott's is funny as hell, huh? Yeah. <laughs> what was she doing? <laughs> what was she doing? I don't know. I had to hear it again. She was just like know. laughing at us. Yeah. Pop. Yes. Like that, but it ain't even gotta be like that. <laughs> <laughs> That's yeah. good stuff. She's funny. Yeah, that made me giggle. She's a she's a classic. Classic. We gotta do Missy Elliott week, have we? I don't think so. We have not. I don't even know she's if Missy great. Elliott's been. Even, this might be the first time we've seen her on the channel. I think you're right. What but, a shame. We definitely uh, had some suggestions for it. Yeah, but yeah. Once again, Keish Cold. Great voice, Missy Elliott. Is she might be shining more in this song than I uh, than I've heard in the first three from Keisha Cole. She is singing her heart out on this one. She, I, I don't I mean, think she, she was holding been, back at all. Of the but past this three. one is this one just seems like it's I don't know. It's nailing it a little, just a little bit more for me. Hey man, you know. Hey, you never know. When they play it in the car, they gon' drop they tops like damn. Fat that's hot. They gon' mix it with Biggie. It was all a dream, like damn, that's hot. Right. Me and Keisha don't stop till the tape don't top, like damn, that's hot. Now understand why I take my time. Cause you come with alibis, tryna get me to see this where you tryna be.
little Kim don't stress him. Yeah, yeah. Kick them all straight to the curb like Becca. Uh -huh. Broke up with my ex, he would huff for now. But little do she know she's just a rebound. Hey. Calling my phone, she's so out of pocket. I've been there before, oh girl, you need to stop it. When he's with you, he's wishing it was me. You might be where he's at, but I'm where he wanna be, baby. Girl. The way you should, then let it go. Wow. Wow. Did that get way louder on that last chorus? It got intense. There yeah. was a lot going on. It, the song got louder just in general. It might have been. What you had to live by me. After Lil' Kim's. After Lil' Kim's verse. Yeah. yeah. Is it still Kim? No, no, no. Like, 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 I've been there before, girl. You need to stop it. When he's with you, he's wishing right it was me. You might be where he's at, but I'm where he wanna be, baby. Yeah. Dude, it goes up like 5 dB. It's so much louder. Everything is way louder. It's Dude, awesome. Lil' Kim is in, intense. Her uh, her rapping is kind, of, it kind of scared me. Oh, you shocked? <laughs> well, I'm not shocked. I, scared? I, I feel threatened. Oh, let's hear it. <laughs> Do she know she's just a rebound? Hey. Calling my phone. So out of pocket, I've been there before, oh girl. You need to stop it. When he's with you, he she sounds like she means business, is what I'm saying. Mm, yeah. Yeah, Missy Elliott was a little. At least and more I don't think I want to be a part of any of that business. <laughs> <laughs> at least I know in this song, Missy Elliott comes off a little bit more of a jokester. Little Kim's just trying to is trying Look, to let you know she feels serious. That's, yeah, yeah, like that's you got it. There's something serious. you got to figure out. Yeah, I'm I'm too goofy, you know. I can't handle yeah. all the seriousness. Yeah, that just made you. Yeah, something along those lines. I mean, wow. I like it. Her tone is awesome. Yeah, definitely. But I was just like, you know, Lil Kim. Uh, what's her story? Did, wasn't she with uh, a rapper? Was she with? I don't want to say something that's gonna make me look like an idiot. <laughs> she was with a rapper. I think she dated a rapper for a little while. Maybe I don't know, Mike. We have three hundred videos on the internet that make us look kind of stupid. <laughs> so all right, well, I might as well. <laughs> <laughs> we'll get there. Uh, Dang, dude, this bass line in this song is just, I could feel like I could listen to this beat and break down this beat. Like, it's just, it's so good. All of it is so good. Yeah. I love seeing Fat Joe in the music video. Yeah, he kind of snuck in there for us. Okay, here, pause real quick. It's kind of like so, an 80s tone. I think those... Yeah, 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 the bass. Uh, well, I think this beat is like a remix of a Biggie song. Oh, that makes more sense. Yeah, yeah, I think I because I recognize the chords and Missy Elliott says she, oh, she refer references Biggie. Yeah. Oh no! Right here. I think it was all a dream. I think it's this song. Yeah, they like revamped. That they like took more the sense. they took the instrumental and added a fresh beat. Because I I didn't think the song was from that era, but I kept thinking in my mind like, man, this sounds like a Biggie song or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It sounds like a song that Biggie would have yeah. made or like that. They kind of like mid '90s hip hop. They like re remixed, resampled it. They took some of the sounds and then made it sound more modern. I, I see. think that's what they did. And there's our there's our guy. <laughs> yeah. I was so excited back. to see him. Lean I mean back. I think this Lean is common, back. well, especially back in these days and maybe even like who we saw Drake in someone's music video. Oh, in yeah. Justin Bieber's music video. Yeah. And Drake's also just in like uh Pursuit of Happiness by oh, Kid Cudi. Right. He's just in it. So he's not I think, on the song, he's just in the video. I think especially I I think Maybe especially it's more of a Drake thing. Especially in the hip hop thing. No, no, no. Especially in the hip hop world, they like bigger rappers or artists would have the up and coming artists that they were like championing. Yeah. 
They would put them in their music videos just to get them, give them some FaceTime, you know? Be like, Dude, here's the next guy. He's coming up. He's Drake up being and considered the up-and-comer, like, little guy in a Kid Cudi video is crazy. Yeah, well. I mean, Kid Cudi is obviously a big artist, but, like, Drake became, you know. Yeah, like one of the biggest. Probably the biggest rapper of the 2010s. Yeah. I mean, yeah, he was massive. He still is. Biggest rapper <laughs> of 2020s. Um, but, Yeah. Back to this, Fat Joe is here. I I, I don't know who is he he's connected with. Maybe Missy Elliott, maybe, or maybe maybe, maybe Lil Kim dated. I don't know. I'm not gonna start making shit up. <laughs> yeah, we're making shit up. Tell me what the connection is between Fat Joe and uh, one of these. I mean, three. they could all just be on the same label or something. I don't know. Yeah. Well, there was that one music video that had like everyone on it. Um, Oh, too many people. Yeah, what was it? Rock? Um, bedrock. It had Bedrock. Oh, yeah, but they were all actually... I know, rapping. they're all on Young Money. Yeah, yeah. Well, not all of them rapped. It was just like everyone was in that video. But yeah, Nicki Minaj uh, and uh, Drake. Drake and Lil, and the Lil Wayne and then, yeah, the singer and then I think a couple other guys. But anyways, dang, three superstars on one song. This was fun. There's Lil' Kim. Three superstars and one fat Joe in the music video. Lil Kim, was she one of the first Lils? You know? Yeah. Was she one of the OG Lils? I got asked, who's, Cause, the, fir- who's the first Lil? Because Lil is the mo- probably the most popular like prefix to a rapper's name. Could like be, A yeah. lot of people used big, but Lil is way more popular than that. Well, Fat Joe used fat with a PH. He's PH? I don't know. I think he's F-A-T. Oh, really? I don't know. Um... But yeah, was Lil Kim the first Lil? There's Lil Bow Wow. He Lil, was early on. Lil Bow Wow. Well, Lil Lil Wayne first started coming up in the '90s. Even before Lil Kim. I don't know, because Lil Wayne. I know Lil Wayne is like real young. Is there a big Wayne? On, uh, <laughs> Lil Wayne was really young on what's that song? Back that thing up. Mm. Yeah, I remember watching it. And I, I think he and he says drop it like it's hot. That's what oh, he says no, in the video. That's his only thing. I don't think he actually raps. He oh, just, he's like, drop it like it's hot. Yeah, drop it like it's hot. And yeah, he's walking, and I think he's even like a teenager. He's really young. It's like 99 or 98 or something. Uh, I remember watching that video because the only thing I know about music videos was uh, the, the, the only time we ever had, or I ever had cable and had MTV or VH1 was in like 2009 2008 2009 Mm -hmm. and there was always the 40 sexiest videos and they just ran it all the time because those channels don't have anything on them anyways and so it was just the 40 sexiest videos and i remember uh back that thing up was one of the most popular oh yeah yeah it was one of the sexiest videos very nice i forget what number one was though now if she's lil kim does that imply that there is a kim or big kim big kim medium kim because, yeah, why, well, I'm assuming Lil' Kim is short. <laughs> Maybe. Uh, I don't know. I, well, yeah, what's, what's the little, what's the little, like, is, is there any, is there, are there any uh, rules to, to adding a little in front of your name? Do you like, have to be, like, a second or, like, like a junior or, like, smaller? Nah, well. I nah. mean, Lil' Wayne is short. He's a little guy. Right. Lil' Wayne, I think, is, like, 5'4". Lil' four. He's Bow Wow was a child. Yeah, Lil' so, Bow Wow was a child. Can I be Lil Mike? I'm more of a Big Mike, you though. I'm more of a Big Mike guy. I wouldn't call you a Big Mike. Big Mike. <laughs> big Mike. I would call you more just Mike. All right. Well, I'm going to stop. Medium I'm gonna Mike. Ed- I'm going to edit this part out where Joe doesn't agree with me. <laughs> oh, whoa, 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 Mike, man. You're so sad about uh, it. Ready? Yeah. <laughs>